Hello, good morning fellow teachers, parents, tutors, viewers. Uh, I'm Mrs. Erlinda Claveria from the Philippines. I'm a retired public school master teacher. I'm also a tutor, a demonstration teacher, and a book writer. I'm also the one who invented or created the E.S. Claveria's beginning reading technique and also the E.S. Claveria's uh, mathematics techniques for pupils who cannot memorize the basic facts. Now this time, I'm going to discuss the E.S. Claveria's techniques in mathematics uh, so that the children will no longer count their fingers, uh, they will no longer memorize the um, multiplication tables, the subtraction, the addition, and the division facts. Now, there are four kinds of techniques in addition. Number one, the upward technique. The um, Number two, the copy technique. Number three, the downward technique. And number four is the repetition technique. Now, if the children will be able to master these four kinds of techniques, they, they will have no longer problems in addition. So, we will start now. Now, uh, upward technique first. Now, the upward techniques or the upward technique is applicable to five numbers. One, two, three, four, five. Now, I consider these uh, five numbers as young numbers because when you count them, they must be counted upward huh? because they are still growing up. So, uh, to avoid finger counting, the child will hold the pencil and count the edges of the numeral instead of counting the fingers. Now, here, one is counted as one of course and then two now this front edges of numeral two will be counted mm. do not count the back part because it will become three only the front edges now we have perfect three uh, one two three one two three and then we have four uh, close the uh, four upper edges of four to make it one uh, one two three four because if it is open of course uh, four will become five so close the upper part one two three four now there are only four edges in five one two three four so it's lacking to make it five include the back part of five huh? One, two, three, four, five. So that is the secret so that the pupils will no longer count their fingers because finger counting is very time consuming, isn't it? All right, now let's apply this uh, in addition. Now, in uh, using this upward counting, you will uh, you will always uh, start from the bigger number by reading it first. Example, we have one plus nine. Of course, the bigger number is nine. So read first nine. Now, always read first the bigger number. Then uh, continue to count the uh, the smaller number. Uh, why 9 10 again 9 10 the answer is 10 observe proper alignment and then we have 2 we have 2 and for example we have 6 the bigger number is 6 6 7 8 the answer is Eight. Can you see it? All right. We come to three. Three. I will make it bigger. Then 
we have 8. The bigger number is 8. 8, 9, 10, 11. The answer is 11. We come to 5. 5 plus 7. Read first 7. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The answer is 12. So, even if you reverse it, so for example, the upper number is on top, you will always look for the bigger number and read first. Say, so for example, number 9 is on top. Then, plus 3. Of course, you read first 9 and then proceed to count the uh, smaller number. Uh, 9, 10, 11, 12. So, the same procedure for other numbers. Say, for example, we have 8. 8 plus 4. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The answer is 12. Then we have 6. 6 plus 1. Read first 6. 6, 7. Right. That is the way how to solve the um, up, uh, upward counting. Always start from the bigger number and then proceed counting upward to the edges of the smaller number. Now, the next technique is uh, copy technique. Now, copy technique is applicable for 9 with uh, carried number 1 on top. Say, for example, we have... Um, 3 plus 8 and then we have 9 plus 5. Right. We start from 8. 8, 9, 10, 11. Carry 1. Now, 9 has carry 1 over, over 8. So, 1 in 9 is, we call this tandem. Huh? They are partner, <laughs> partner. Uh, they are partner in crime, tandem. Now, you, we know that 9 plus 1 is 10. So this is 10, the sum of 10. And then this one is the outsider. Uh, the outsider is uh, not included in um, tandem. Uh, this is the outsider. So you will just copy the outsider if you see the tandem, 1 in 9. Diba? Because uh, it is... Uh, it is a uh, the sum of ten, and then if you if you add it to five, it will become fifteen. So the answer is one hundred fifty-one. Another one we have um, a little bit longer horizontally. So for example, uh, nine plus four, then we have nine plus two, then. 9 plus 8, then we have mm, 3 plus 9. Alright, you will notice that in addends, uh, the presence of the presence of 9 is always there uh, in copy technique. Say for example, we, have, we will start from bigger number 9, 10, 11, 12. Carry 1. Now, this is now the tandem. So, the outsider is 8. This one, you copy only the numeral 8. That is one. 18. That is 18. Carry 1. Now, you look for the tandem. We have 1 and 9. So, the outsider is 2. Copy 2. The outsider is 2. Therefore, you copy this numeral 2. That is 12. Carry 1. 
This is now the tandem. Then the outside there is four. Therefore, the answer is 14. And very easy, isn't it? No. Even if it is very long, it will be very easy if you will use this technique. Uh, copy technique. We call it copy technique. Alright? Uh, we will stop here uh, for the meantime. And then we will proceed to the next episode. Alright? Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, share, and then um, hit that notification bell so, so that you will be notified always. Now, the next episode will be um, the downward counting and then the, um, what else? The reputation technique. So it's very easy. Addition is very easy. And ASL rest technique is very, very interesting and very easy. Thank you for watching.